big impacts were happening in Universe 6. All Saiyans were impressed with what they are seeing. The Saiyan who just now everyone believed was a weak being and who had won the qualifying fights by sheer luck was fighting equally and even making the God of War Ares hesitate. Who is the Saiyan Kakarot who challenges even the gods? Hey, how's it going? Just yet to remind you to click the like button, subscribe yet to the channel so you don't miss any videos and stay well inside our entire universe of Dragon Ball. Without further ado, let's get started. At that moment, Ares, with great mastery, started to land several blows on Goku. Even with his Super Saiyan Blue form elevated, he still feels a great pressure of energy. Goku says, <laughs> It seems like he was really crazy with normal techniques and finding a god like that. If I really show my powers, maybe someone will find out who I am. <sighs> but I don't have a choice. The way it's going here, if I don't do it, I'm done for. <clears throat> This guy is very strong, and I'm still sure he's not fine with all his might. Ares watches and says, <laughs> Good. It seems that you finally understand that you won't be able to defeat me with just that power, don't you? If you have any other skills, I think it would be time for you to use them. You're always like that? <laughs> <sighs> You analyze the enemies and then you don't defeat them. <laughs> I think about it. If this is how you fight, you will surely be defeated with great ease by the Great War Emperor. At that moment, Goku starts laughing and says, <laughs> You're pretty strong. I fought very powerful guys. Not long ago, I fought a warrior named Yami. He was probably stronger than you. In fact, I've never seen a mortal as strong as that guy. At that moment, Ares says, You know Yami? How did this guy even fight the seventh strongest warrior in the entire universes? He fought Yami and still managed to stand? Who is this guy anyway? At that moment, Goku starts to raise his key even more. As Goku increased his energy even more, the entire audience that was watching and not believing that a Saiyan could get stronger was watching everything that was happening. The audience said, What do you mean? Can a Saiyan get that powerful? How can a Saiyan raise his strength to the level of a god? This is impossible! This warrior is a fraud! At that moment, an angry cauliflower begins to speak. Hey, you assholes! Stop talking like that! He is a Saiyan who is fighting for all of us! Just like you, he also has dreams and is here to prove and show his true strength! And his true worth. The entire audience begins to observe for a few moments what Kalifla has to say. Kalifla concludes. All this time, we've been under the tyranny of some gods of destruction. For all that time, we never had the opportunity to be able to hear and be heard. Every time we went up against the god of destruction, the god of destruction eradicated a different planet. It seems that we were cogs. Just pawns to all of it. And we were a mere idiots. And this time, the one who is funny is the god of war who knows how to create a great catastrophe in everything he goes through. And a Saiyan who is funny with his thoughts on our familiars. And on all of us. Who do you want to win? Who do you believe has the potential? If a Saiyan manages to raise his power even more and manages to equal his power to that of a god. And it's because he must be chosen by all of us to be their next king. Let's believe in the level we ourselves are capable of. Mortals may yet rule everything one day. At that moment, it seems that all the Saiyans resolved and understood what Caulifla was trying to say. All Saiyans realized that Goku, or rather Kakarot, was not the problem. But maybe the solution for times of peace and harmony for the warriors. Saiyans knew that King Sadala could do a good reign as a god of destruction, but King Sadala was not the one who was fighting for justice for all. So he was the one who was showing his true strength. The one who was impressing everyone with his fighting power was the Saiyan, that Saiyan, who until now was an unknown being. In a few moments, a scream is heard. Come on, Kakarot! Let's go, Kakarot! We have faith in you! Kakarot! Everyone starts screaming. Frieza looks and says, How insolent you Saiyans are! 
Just now they were shouting my name. Now they're screaming the name of the damn son Goku. <laughs> well, it doesn't bother me. I'll finish them off in a blink of an eye. At that moment, Goku fighting Ares activates his Ultra Instinct. Ares is impressed and says, No, they're screaming your name, Kakarot. At that moment, Goku fighting Ares activates his Ultra Instinct. Ares is impressed and says, <clears throat> This guy manages to use the Ultra Instinct, the technique that even the gods of destruction have a hard time using. Who are you anyway? At that moment, King Sadala appears and says, Hmm, interesting fight, isn't it? Goku looks at King Sadala and starts watching. Eri says, That insolent being! You want to stop our fight! If you try to do something like that, I'll never forgive you! At that moment, King Sadala says, This is nothing more important. But we have a false classification here in this tournament. The Kakarot participant is actually Son Goku, the mortal who fought in the Tournament of Power and fought against Jiren, that warrior who had strength levels linked to a god of destruction. Goku barely defeated Jiren, but as much as the battle was gigantic, his universe managed to win and cause all the other universes to be brought back. We can't just forget that this Tournament of Power only appeared because Goku asked Xenosama for him to know the strength level of other warriors from other universes. A greedy thought and wish. At that moment, Goku speaks. What? Uh, no! Uh, I can't believe it! I'm unmasked! I got caught! Galifla watches and says, uh, so King Sadala found out about everything! Bakura says, No, no! It can't be now! Damn it! What will happen? All participants were watching. All participants start shouting, Goku, Goku, Goku! Win this fight, Goku! King Sadala starts to laugh and says, <laughs> It seems that no one cared about it. So if the audience doesn't care about what this fight is, keep going. Fight till the end. At that moment, the tournament classifier observes and speaks. If King Sadala authorized the continuation of the fight, then now the Kakarot participant or better Son Goku of Universe 7 continue fighting against Ares, the god of war. Ares starts to raise his power more, and the whole ground starts to shake. And in little moments, the whole sky starts to darken. Ari says, <laughs> It is time to fight for real. If you have shown the Ultra Instinct mastered, now you realize you're fighting the God. And that will be your end, Son Goku. To be continued. The battle between Goku and Ares is getting more and more intense, but apparently it's reaching its climax. Who will be the winner of this battle? So hey, what do you believe and what do you imagine about all of this? Regardless of what it is, it is more than important that you arrive exposing it in your comments so that we can enter into that crazy debate. Don't forget to click the like button, subscribe here to the channel and hit the bell so you don't miss any videos. And that's it for today, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.